Please don't tell me you're <laughs> Okay. Don't, 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 don't do that, don't do that. Hi guys and welcome back to my channel and today I'm doing another driving lesson with my nephew, Love Jet. So today's lesson we're going to be driving in the rain so we'll be talking about that a little bit on the go. I want to be able to let you do most of driving on your own where I'm not talking you through anything so do as much as you can on your own. We're going to be practicing through a lot of the bigger traffic like crossroads in the area around here today and trying to keep up with traffic and then introducing some of the roundabouts a little bit as well. You're familiar with most of them, aren't you? Yeah, most Around of them here. I am, yeah. So we had a little bit of trouble on the last lesson, was it? On mini roundabouts, or was it? Yeah, the one I think so. Was last it one. one. Was it the last one? It was. Wait, was it? No, I think it was the one before. Oh, it, no, it was the one before when... It was it. Yeah, the one when we were in... Um, Chiswick. Yeah. Yeah, it was that one. It was the one before. Yeah. Yeah, okay. That's fine. Okay, so when you're ready, we're going to get started. So remember, I do have the pedals, but I'm not, I don't really need to use them, and I don't think I've had to use them. Okay? So yeah, when you're ready, we're going to get started. Okay, and then drive off when you're ready. <laughs> yeah, you realise, you realise, don't worry. Turn on that front wiper. Twist it, we've talked about how to do it. There you go. So we'll leave it on now. Okay, so we're going to turn left at the end here, so think about what you want to be doing for this. Graduated. <laughs> Can't take it. So that was definitely a gap with the Prius. So you can see he flashed his headlights there, yes? As soon as we go left, there is a width restriction. So have to be yeah, you have to position um, straight away as soon as we go in. to that top corner. A bit right. Tiny bit. Okay. Well done. More right. More right. That left side was getting quite close there. We've got width restrictions later on as well. anybody a reason to overtake you, okay? What's going on ahead? 
Okay, so I'm going to sit here in silence now. We'll try to. I want you to do as much as you can on your own. Don't back. Yes, you move back. So what we're going to do is, at the end, we're going to turn left. We're going towards South Hall today. Do we need a signal? Over here. Yeah. Because well, yeah. you can only turn left. True. But if I was crossing the road over there, how would I know you're going that way? True. Pedestrians. We talked about the importance of signals for pedestrians. Yeah. Mm -hmm. there on the entry lobby. Yeah. <laughs> 
scheduled to do a meeting up here, but it's not that bad. Try and give yourself more space not to get that close to another car. <laughs> okay, take the next road on your left. See on the left there? Yeah. On the left, the mm. driving strip. Yeah, the learner car got something. Turn right. T junctions, just do them slower. Use first gear at the end rather than just coming out like that, okay? Be really careful with this one. time on your own at the roundabout turn right. Anybody to your right? Was the person in front turning right? Yeah, so we could have gone first, couldn't we? I know the traffic on the left was slowing coming in, but had you started, they would have stopped for you. Yeah? So whenever it comes to roundabouts, always look ahead to make sure they're not turning, and then look on your immediate right. And that's the two that we're mainly waiting for. Front and right. Front and right that we're mainly waiting for on like the what mini. What do you mean? Like, look out front to see if they're turning. Because if the person in front is doing a right turn, they're going this way. You would have to stop for them. Yeah. If they're not going. If, if so, they're going let's straight. They're turning left or straight. It doesn't matter. So. We we can enter. Right. Yeah. And then the person on your immediate right, you have to wait for them because they're coming in as a straight or a right turn. Is that making more sense? So let's say the person on the right is turning left, then what? Then we can go in. You just need to make sure as you enter that nobody is coming in from your right section, this this little bit here. But if they're going this way, then it's fine. So that's why that person on the left really doesn't do much for us. Do you want to do hazard perception on the high street where you talk out loud about your hazards? <laughs> There'll be lots on there. What do you mean, like, I have to say what's the hazard? Yeah. So what you think might um, affect you, basically. You know how you click in the hazard perception? Yeah. Just talk out loud. For example, road works on the left, bus on the right. Nobody's looking to cross. <laughs> okay, so traffic lights turn right. How was your week? It was alright, I had a lot of exams in, so I was just revising this one. <laughs> had a lot of so exams in it. A levels are so hard compared to GCC. Yeah, it's a big step up. And you have to make sure your fold is on time. Watch this bit here. Oh, oh, oh. Please don't tell me you're <laughs> Okay. But I thought I could go. Let's go. No, you could not have gone before the left. Wait, I thought if you're going... Oh wait, that's if you're going straight. You can go without... Left and straight is your priority, not turning right. Okay. 
<laughs> you chose the right person to move in front of, didn't you? <laughs> He's definitely in the middle you are. I know. That's a hazard. Yeah. That's not a hazard. <laughs> <laughs> okay, no, calm down now. Okay, wipers. They're not working. Just twist it again. And then twist it again. You can just twist it back down again. If they don't go off, just mm. press the button on the end, okay? Yeah. yeah. There you go. Space for us at the moment. But we could have went if there was space. If there was space, we could have gone, yeah. yeah, yeah. Okay, now make sure it's clear before you enter now. Yeah? Just watch that black car, he's not moving yet, so we can go in. Keep it fairly straight, close to the roundabout. Is that okay? Okay, so we're going to go left down to the high street this way. traffic ahead is moving you can keep going forward yeah. come on because the bus is moving we don't need to stop there because the traffic's moving anyways it's only if they're stationary ahead of you Junction, we're going to turn right. I just want to recreate that traffic light scene from earlier. Yeah. <laughs> so you know what you should be doing, yes? Yeah. Okay. Do you want me to talk you through it or you can do it on your own? <coughs> do it on your own. Okay, so we're going right towards Asta. go green, we go into the middle and position towards Asda at a 45 angle and then we wait there. No, no, don't, 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 don't do that, don't do that. Okay, keep going forward now. Don't do that next time. Could you tell if it was clear? That's what I was going to ask Okay, I know you're edging forward, but the car coming through is not going to be slow. They're going to be coming at 30 miles per hour. You are not to edge forward from that position. 
You have to sit there until the traffic moves. Does that make sense, Levy? Yeah. Do you remember this is the one where I had by accident? Yes? Yeah. And because of the same thing you're doing, I'm edging forward. And then turn right at the end. Brake and clutch quickly with speed pump. Oh! Mm, 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 that hurt my soul. Look both ways before you come out of here, please. These speed bumps are not nice. Look at the size of them. It's a brake. Now come off the brake. You might even have to switch into first. That's how bad these ones are. <laughs> yeah. Okay, roundabout, follow the road ahead. And then when we get to the traffic lights, turn left. And you kind of go this way. <laughs> And then turn from here a little bit. It's just there's just a lot of space. <laughs> turn left. They're painted like a little circle. It's because lorries um, and trucks and stuff, they turn in there. So they can't exactly raise it and paint it higher. two cars can really go forward. Now the third one, this blue one, shouldn't really be there because now they're in that position when the lights have changed and they shouldn't be going forward now. really see can we so because of that blind spot you simply wait I think that's it. you can budge up a tiny bit but don't go into the lane so if you can't see it just sit it's empty Are you sure yes. okay that's fine Now the guy behind, he came through with you there, but he should not have that Chris exactly, yeah. Okay, we're going to try it one more time. Keep looking both ways in case someone steps in front of you on this side. Is he waiting? Okay, go on, in you go. I have no idea why they waited, but drive normally. So it's back to 30 now, and traffic lights turn right. Signal. So you see how this side is a much bigger blind spot? Yeah. Okay, now the traffic light is changing, so let's go. So as soon as it starts changing, you need to clear it. So you're happy with that now? So 
know exactly when it's safe to go. If you can pull over and park up on the left in that big space. How do we park up left here? If you just go up to the tree, okay? It's a brake and clutch, but don't park as close as the car in front is. Just keep it rolling and get yourself rough. That's great, no, thank you. All right, secure the car. All right, brilliant. That's the end of your driving lesson, loved it. How was your drive today? It was better than last week, I would say, yeah. Yeah, last week we went on completely different roads, that's why. Um, okay, started off good. Happy with the small roads, the mini roundabouts. Bit of hesitation because you were looking left and waiting for them. And I think the only reason why that right turn issue happened, you know when you tried to go before the learner yeah. car, is because we were just talking about mini roundabouts and who we wait for. I think so, yeah. And I think that's what confused you. But that rule doesn't apply at traffic light. Traffic light is just a normal right turn. We wait for oncoming traffic. Okay? But um, we practiced this last one a few times. Does that make sense why it's not safe to edge forward? Yeah. Yeah? Because as soon as you edge forward, you're in their path already and they could be coming full speed 30 miles per hour. Yeah. Okay? So I hope you guys find that video useful. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. And thank you for everyone that's been watching.